What's going on guys, Akko here, and today I'm here to teach you the Reflect Option Select. This is a follow-up to the last video where I showed you the benefits of using 4LL in class situations rather than simply mashing light and hoping for the best. So the input for this Option Select is to hold back, and then you're going to tap LMS. And you're going to do it extremely fast. You're gonna do it as fast as you possibly can. And if you do it correctly, you'll notice that the S will never come out. You can look at the controller at the bottom to see just how quickly I'm inputting it. It has to be very, very fast. And the point of it is that you do not want the S to ever come out on their block or on hit. Once you've practiced this enough and you can do it enough times without the S ever coming out, it's time to move on to the next stage. We're going to once again record the opponent doing an LLL. Make sure that in your recording settings, whenever you record, make sure it's on quick. That way you can very easily press the record button, LLL, and then stop the recording. Once you trigger a clash, you will now see that you will automatically get a reflect. The reason this happens is because when you clash with somebody, you are put into a cancelable state. But when putting it on someone's block, you're doing it so fast that the animation goes through and your ass never comes out. And that is the Reflect OS in a nutshell. If you really end up having a lot of trouble with this, a easier variation that's similar to the 4LL that I showed from the previous video is that you can also do hold back LML. If you do this, you will beat them out with a jab. And of course, if they do nothing, the L doesn't come out so you can continue your string. So either one, if you use the LML or LMS, both are really great options after a clash moment. And that brings us to the end of the video. Thanks so much for listening. Hope you learned something and I will see you in the next one. Peace.